First memory of Jordan is the flu game. I just think, man, just off the heart, the dude was throwing up everywhere and he was still just going out there and giving it his all. And that's what it comes down to when you're the greatest and the best of the best. And some people think with just a little nudge on them, they're hurt and they don't want to play, but this, this dude had the flu and he's, he's still coming. So, I mean, when Jordan was there, everybody's watching. Jordan was the, was the prime of the NBA and still is. And very similar to Kobe, killer, competitiveness, stays in the gym. And uh, those, those are my favorite two players, only because of that. The talent and all that stuff will come, but I mean, those guys are just killers and they're competitive, and that's the main thing that brings those guys, that's the main thing that brings those guys to the top. Even when I think with LeBron and, and guys like that right now, they're struggling because LeBron doesn't have that killer right now that Kobe and, and the Jordan has, and, and that's what people don't understand. And, and when you have that heart and the killer and competitiveness, that's what happens. Jordan, you're gonna end up like Jordan, a guy who's the best player who's ever played the game because he's, he's a killer. Yeah, I mean, it's hard to have. Like when I look at Kobe, those are the only guys I watch, Kobe and Jordan. Because I think uh, everybody has talent level on the floor, but they gotta know how to separate yourself when everybody else has talent. And, and that's when you take people's hearts, it's hearts, it's hearts.